YouTube Wade here. Got a quick uh, review for you. Um, lately, I've been on this kick trying to find a knife on eBay for a cheap price. Something just to do my first knife review ever on. Um, so, what I chose was one of the Damascus knives. Usually, nine times out of ten, they are a Pakistani Damascus. This one here was listed as Alabama Damascus, a 1095 N620 or something. Um, anyways, it came to me in the mail yesterday. So, what I'm going to do is show you guys, let you guys tell me what you think of this knife of course later on I'll go out and test it and stuff um, right now it's like 635 in the morning uh, I live here in Sarasota Florida um, so it's about to start getting hot pretty soon um, anyways let's move on to the knife I'll give you a quick show through of it and uh, you can tell me what you think so for starters, this is the sheath, decent leather sheath, um, you know, pretty thick, it's got these buttons on it, which are the seal of Oklahoma, they work very well, uh, my car to handle. Nice silver bolster pinned on uh, with silver pins. And then, of course, it has four brass pins and one mosaic pin holding the handle on. One thing that I wasn't too impressed about with this knife was the fact that it only had like a four inch handle. I got pretty big hands, as you can see. Um, but, anyways, let's pull this thing out. And there it is. I've been looking for kind of like a chopper style knife. And I've been real interested in trying some of this Damascus. I mean, I have knives ranging from about every steel that you can have. Um, which I will start doing some reviews on those later on. But I have to say that this guy from Oklahoma did a great job. I wish I could remember what his name was. I'll probably look it up and post it in a later video but it is real Damascus for sure it goes all the way through the handle you guys probably can't see that because I'm filming on my tablet but um, let's see if we can get it on there for you yeah it's just not gonna show up. Beautiful, beautiful pattern. My personal opinion, he did a very good job. As you can see, yeah, there's some scratches right here that I started trying to whittle a couple sticks with it, see what it would do. Um, one thing I have a gripe about is the handles, it fits my hand, but right here right here in this point it kind of digs into your finger a little bit when you're uh, you know carving wood or trying to do a little bit of a wood task um, not a big deal something I can mod because I mod my knives usually to fit me anyways uh, but just something for somebody to know if, if you were to go out and look for this particular knife. I'm not sure that you'll find it. It's a it's a custom, semi-custom I should say. I'm not even sure what the deal is with it. I've never seen another one like it. Um, yeah, so, you know, I, I, I'm not too sure of the availability of it. The um, best thing I can say is if you are interested in this knife, Go on eBay and just search. See if you can find one. 
But, anyways, look at that. Look at that mosaic pen. Very, very well done. Handles are nice and smooth and rounded. No, I mean, very good job. I won this thing on eBay for less than $20. Like, literally, like $16. So my next point on this knife would obviously to be out in the woods with it and see how it works. So, go down in the comments, let me know what you think. Of course, if you like the video, hit a thumbs up. If you don't, hit a thumbs down. Once again, this is Jay Wade coming to you. From Sarasota, Florida. One more shot of that knife. Anyways, we'll catch you on the wood side.